Well, hello everybody. We are at Emerald TMS. This is a new treatment in Eugene, um, FDA approved uh, for severe depression. And this is Stephanie, our very ultra brave uh, patient who we visited with last week. It was what, like three months, three weeks ago, probably. You had Something just like started, right? Mm -hmm. So you were not knowing how this was going to work, weren't sure. Um, but you guys, she walked in the office with a big, huge smile on her face. Mm. So yeah. tell me, tell people what's going on. Uh, it's been kind of like, um, I would uh, describe it as maybe like a, a jump start. It's been super helpful. Like my batteries were dead and they're recharged is kind of what it feels like. It's so pretty you, great. So you, before you didn't go out of the house. Nope. <laughs> and now you're enjoying uh, the holiday season. Yeah. Been shopping and, and doing things with friends and family and, um, I have, you know, plans, busy, busy plans for the holidays and. It's, it's been a pretty drastic change for me. So tell people the difference. What I mean, describe that for, because other folks may not understand. So what's that different feeling? So like where I started to, to what it feels like now. Yeah. Um, so prior to treatment, it was kind of just, uh, you know, spending every day in your pajamas and, and not really knowing what to do with yourself. And you might not have a specific mood or sometimes you're irritable, like it just fluctuates a bunch. and. I don't really know what's going on, but um, flash forward to today, it's more, I definitely feel more uh, light inside, um, definitely more cheery and more excited about, you know, the future uh, looking forward is, you know, exciting, whereas before it was terrifying. So, um, yeah, it's been a, it's been great. <laughs> so there's numbers that they use to determine your level of depression. Yeah, it's called the PHQ-9 form. And 19 is, is that where you were? Yeah, that's where I came in. Um, and you have to be 10 to be... Considered you're, you're, in remission. In remission. So people under 10 and under are not treated. You don't have to be treated. Mm -hmm. And you were at 11 last time you were in. And today I was at a 7. <laughs> that's pretty exciting. You that's were pretty very thrilled. Exciting. Yeah. So that very means, exciting. That means you, you have a new normal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what's that like? Uh, it's pretty great. <laughs> it's really great. That's kind of a nice Christmas present, isn't it? It is. It's a, a, a present I, uh, I really didn't think was possible. Uh, it didn't feel like it was ever going to be possible to kind of get, get out of the, the very dark place I was in. So this has been kind of a dream come true. So why don't you get in your chair, go get your treatment, and I'll show you going on here like this. <laughs> okay, so you guys, so this is the treatment. And Roger, come in here, and I want you to talk really close yep. so you can talk. So tell us kind sure. of what's going on here. Well, Brennan is going. To, we we've uh, gone through a process where we have uh, determined where to locate this magnetic pulse on Stephanie's uh, left side of Stephanie's. Go ahead, Brennan. Brain. You can keep doing it while you're doing and, it. And uh, yeah, and so uh, now that that's done, that's called a brain mapping. So they and, brain map her first. Brain mapping is first stage. and Just walk in front of me, dude. You then, do whatever oh, you got to yeah, do. Go you don't don't let then, me stop you. I'll move around. And then Brendan, who's a registered technologist and our head technologist, will position the coil over certain uh, uh, parameters that have been set by this machine so that they are duplicatable every so, time she comes in. So we know where to position the coil. So this is an electromagnetic? It's an electromagnetic pulse. Okay. And it goes, uh, it, it goes through uh, the dorsal lateral prefrontal cortex on the left side. And uh, it create, it restarts some of the circuits that have essentially uh, kind of gone to sleep. And these circuits are uh, circuits that have to do with emotional response. They're connected into deeper parts of the brain, but they're restarted. And as Stephanie said, it's kind of like a jump start. And that's what it is, and uh, and and we're very excited. Uh, that's got to be good news for you when you hear wonderful news. And uh, Stephanie is uh, kind of our gold standard right now, <laughs> right now, and we're so happy for her. And uh, we're trying to get the word out that this is a viable, a proven modality, which aids in treatment of depression. Does not replace psychotherapy does not replace all medications. In some patients it does, but it does definitely uh, is an adjunct to treatment. And in Stephanie's case, uh, like I said, the gold standard, 
the walking model. Right there here. we go. It's, it's, it's going there. <laughs> and Stephanie, you said one of the things that makes this work the most is the staff here. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think uh, I think I'm very lucky to have Alicia and Brendan and, and you know the people here that they have. Hey, thanks. It's uh, it's been a pretty big part of what makes the experience so pleasant. Can these treatments be applied if one is currently on anxiety, depression medications? Um, I am on both. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> it, Somebody's asking that on here. Oh. That's what they're uh, they're doing. So, uh, Brandon, there's, there's there's nothing on there that's like HIPAA, right? Um, hang on. Here we go. Okay, all right. I just <clears throat> want to make sure that we're doing everything we to protect you, but also you are so brave, and we love you for that because you're t you're letting people know um, that this is okay. So, you guys, this is where this is what has already been mapped out, and they're gonna put this on her noggin in the oh. right place. That's a, that's that's my mom's term for the head is a noggin. Yeah, we use it all the time. Yeah, and then it, this is going to put little elect electromagnetic pulses that you're going to hear, and it's going to reconnect and jumpstart the two the, the impulses that go between the two sections of the brain. Correct? Right. Yeah, and that's what makes her do this. See? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Is this the first time at Christmas that you've been happy in a uh, long time? A very long time. Yeah. Yeah. Because, I mean, normally it's uh, it's daunting for someone, you know, that's not in a very good place to be around so many people. and Just keep going. Be expected do what you got to do. Just be full of holiday cheer and spirit, you know. You ready to start? Mm-hmm. Okay. So what does it feel like? Uh, just kind of, well, the more you do it, the less you feel it. Um, I, I, I don't feel it nearly as strongly as I did in the beginning. In the beginning, it's a little, you know, it's something very, very new. So you just kind of have to have an open mind, you know. If, you, if your mind is closed off, you might, I don't know if you would do. Does the Oregon Health Plan cover it? It yes. does. It does. Okay, so Daniel, it, somebody's asking, Daniel, it does cover it. Yeah, I have OHP, and they've been, they've been great. They've, they've covered all of it. So you can just call the office here, Daniel, and um, I'll put the number up there when we're done. Um, in fact, I want him to hear that. What's the number people call here? Can somebody put this in there for me on your comment section? Do you know what the number is? Yeah. We'll get it for you guys. We'll get that. So I want to do one more thing. Can you talk to me? Sure. So this is husband. You are? Ryan. So Ryan, what's this like? Um, it seems to be going well so far. Um, I would say change is subtle, but it seems to be there. Um, and that's a good thing. Um, I think she's more willing to accept challenges. Um, and there seems to be more of an interest in uh, daily goings on. Um, There's so no, that's good. Okay. Uh -huh. um, things seem right. That's got to be easier on your marriage. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. That's awesome. So, you guys. Do you want to oh. Put this? Okay. Here you guys. So, would somebody put this on there? Daniel, can you put 541 735 3241? That's the phone number, 541-735-3241. Put that in the comment section for people, and then I'll put it at the top later on. Um, I, would, I would encourage people, if you're kind of in the same situation, or, or maybe yours isn't as bad, but either way, uh, if, you, if you come in with an open mind, just open your mind to the fact that things other than medication can actually help. Um, and be helpful. Uh, I think that you, it, it could it could be great for you. It could help, and I I I don't want people to be afraid of it because it for me it's been a pretty drastic change, and uh, I'd like people to kind of keep an open mind and and come in and give it a try. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. But I think you'll be surprised. So Roger, I want to ask you something too. So. Um... 
when people say, um, oh, it's just snake oil, another thing out oil. there, um, you, you say what? Well, I say that Stanford, Mayo Clinic, Harvard, and John Hopkins seldom deal in snake oil. And they and, do this. Uh, they've been researching this since 2009. Uh, they all have divisions of TMS therapy. Uh, they're continuing to research TMS therapy. It's being recognized nationwide and worldwide as a as a uh, viable treatment. So, what I would say is that uh, Google is a uh, is a resource of which you can understand and research. So look up TMS, TMS and look up Stanford TMS or Mayo Clinic TMS or uh, Emerald TMS. And, and then you uh, can get more information on it. And then, guys, don't be afraid to just call down here. Or walk in. Make uh, an appointment. Come in. Just come in, and, and they'll get you through the process to see if you're there. You can walk in. You can talk to the people here. You can call us. Uh, and so we're anxious, and we're excited, and we think it's a, we think it's a, a terrific uh, adjunct to uh, psychotherapy in this community. And very happy to have it. Yeah, well, there's a bunch of people out here that are going and uh, talking like about Like I said, it. Stephanie is, is a walking model as far as I'm concerned, and so we're so pleased that it's helped her. So in, in the long term, it's usually a, a yearly thing. She'll probably need to get it adjusted in a year. to go she back. What? She'll have to go through the process again in a year. Perhaps, usually yearly. Or per, maybe not. Uh, okay. I, that's a variable. Uh, some people need to be retreated in a year. Some people do not. Some okay. people... Uh, so it's a variable thing, I and mean, we can't we we can't say exactly what's. But all I can say is that right now, um, we are in a good place. Yeah, and if you need to know about insurance or anything like that, it um, they can office they can talk our, them through that, and they'll go check the process. Call our office yeah. and our uh, and our uh, uh, insurance uh, a, our uh, business manager Kelly Chaltro will help and. Uh, it's so like I said, just walk in and we'll be happy to answer your questions. And they're in the Delta Triad um, over by the Valley River Center is That's where it's right. located. That's so um, I'm going to let her go through the rest of her treat, but I'm going to shoot some more video because this will be on Rick Dancer TV uh, again uh, in January. Uh, you're going to be like a star. Mm -hmm. I do take a fee in case you get discovered, <laughs> just so you know. Okay. Um, and uh, so you guys, if this is something, in fact, I would just suggest share this on your page because you do not know who's in your life or who comes on your page that is struggling with this because people just don't go out and talk about it all the time. So if you put this on your page, you might be helping somebody you don't even know about. So share it on your page and um, we will see you, what is tomorrow? Tomorrow, we're at the car wash um, with a gentleman who's made a green deodorant. So it has no aluminum in it, none of that garbage that you need. And he's going to be showing us, I've been using it, you guys, and I am as fresh as a daisy. <laughs> Roger's walking away. No, it works. And then tomorrow afternoon, we're going to be in Mount Vernon Elementary School talking to kids about the smart reading program. If you don't know what that is, you're going to love it. This is kids reading and how important that is to them. And then on Friday, I'm going to show you what to do with your styrofoam that you get in your Christmas gifts. There is a way to recycle it. St. Vinny's is doing it. They're going to take us out to the machine and we're going to show you how it happens. I'm kind of excited about that. All right. We'll talk to you later. So again, I'll put the number at the top of the screen. Find out more. Nope. It's hard to talk. Okay. We'll talk to you guys soon.